Hi guys, welcome back to Chubby Play. So today on, on our deck sharing day, we'll be sharing with you the new Unified Minds deck that, yeah, that's new mechanism, I guess. So today we'll be focusing on Breloom. So how does it work? Breloom has two attacks. Firstly, Spore, which is just to make your opponent's active Pokemon asleep. And the second attack is if your Pokemon, if your opponent's Pokemon is asleep, this attack does 90 more damage. So he does 120 damage for the second attack if the opponent's Pokemon is asleep. Uh, when you see it like this, right, it's just a bit lackluster. But there are a lot of cards from Unified Minds that actually supports this card. So I'll be going through it shortly. The first card that we have here will be a Mongoose. So a Mongoose with the ability, whenever you play a Pokemon that has 4 attacks from your hand during your turn, you may leave your opponent's active Pokemon asleep and poison. So the more important thing here will be asleep. Because if you remember again, Breloom's attack, if your opponent is asleep, then you'll do 120 damage. Uh, why is this good? Because Breloom itself first attack is called Spore. So when you evolve your Shroomish into Breloom immediately, immediately you can use the second attack, which is your damaging attack. So you don't need to waste one turn to use your Spore. Then the second thing is the Fungus itself, which is the pre-evolution of the Among Us, has Spore attack. So whenever you put a new Fungus on the bench, then you'll be able to get your opponent's Pokemon to be asleep. Okay, then another support that we have from Unified Minds will be Slumbering Forest. Because if a Pokemon is asleep, the owner flips two coins instead of one for that special condition. So instead of 50% chance for the opponent's Pokemon to be awake, opponent will have 25% chance, which is much lower and I think it will be quite significant. So it will disturb the opponent further and there will be a much higher chance that you are able to do your second attack in a few turns, I guess. Not only on one turn, then suddenly opponent's Pokemon become awake again, then you need to make them, make them sleep again. Then another support card that we have from Unified Minds will be Komala. So Komala will be our another attacker. It just to annoy people, I guess. Because if this Pokemon remains asleep between turns, put 6 damage counters on your opponent's active Pokemon. So between turns, you just need to use the first attack to make Komala asleep. And he won't be able to wake up very easily because of the Slumbering Forest, the Stadium card that we have. Then it's just going to do cheap damage on your opponent's Pokemon. Then at the same time, you can make your opponent's Pokemon asleep using your own mechanism. So here I actually run two Komalas, four Fungus for the Spore, and two Among Us because they don't actually need so much of them. Uh, four Four Shroomix and Breloom. Another attacker that I have here is Rowlet and Ellen Executor GX. Uh, I just put this tag team GX because one thing is we won't be having Guzma around. They won't be able to catch this very easily. Custom Catcher is there but it's not as reliable as Guzma so I think it's okay to put. And sometimes I feel a lot of conditions will left the opponent with one prize card less than he will have a better defense with tag team GX compared to only like Breloom for example with 120 HP. Yeah, so I'm still considering whether to put two copies of this of one. We'll see how it goes as we go through the game. So without Guzma, we put two custom catcher. I'm not going to rely on this so much, but I'm just going to put it because why not? And since it's a grass deck, we still have our netball. Uh, netball substitution can also search for your grass energy. Uh, Pokeja, very important in this standard deck nowadays. Uh, two copies of Reset Stem because why not? Uh, Switch, of course. A Life Forest, a support for grass type Pokemon. I was thinking of using it with the Tech Team GX because it has a lot high HP and it's good when you are you are really just trying to attack with the Tech Team Pokemon. Okay, then of course, four copies of Slumbering Forest. Brought Squid because we have no more rescue stretchers, so sometimes we need to shuffle our Pokemon and basic energy from this card pile back into deck. Coach Trainer because we are playing tag team. Draw two cards. If your active Pokemon is tag team, draw two more cards. 
a bit situational, but I think is okay. So, four copies of Cynthia, draw supporter, two copies of Erica, another draw supporter, two copies of Lily, two copies of Tate and Liza, and another thing that we have here is a ringing bell. So, because the setup is not very fast for this deck, so I was thinking of just putting this a ringing bell, make opponents active Pokemon confused when attacking, in case that we are actually quite stuck. So, I'm also considering this to change this into choice band, but... We'll see how it goes. For now, I'm using this. And 8 copies of Grass Energy because I don't like it if you are lacking energy. I uh, prefer more consistency with uh, a bit of higher amount of energy. So, also there's a rather and a Executor GX that needs more energy than others. So, just in case that we need energy, we will have it. So, yeah. That's more or less the overview of this deck. So, let's see how it does in the game. Okay. Okay, I want to consider. I actually want to go first. I think it's always good to go first because we need to evolve our Pokemon quite fast. And we don't actually have a basic, that's quite sad. I thought we actually have a lot of basic Pokemon. We have a lot of basic Pokemon. I've been trying out this deck a few times also actually, but haven't been getting a lot of luck with it. Okay, what is our hand start but I'll put on Pomala first and the phone will show a bit better. Draw me a draw supporter. What is this? A pumpable Ordino deck. Never heard of it. Okay, we might need to retreat so I guess I'll put it there. And the net for I'm thinking if I should get a Zumi, Magnifalum. Since we have our fungus right, I'll actually get Zumi first. Then just in case we can't do anything, maybe just hoping that we can get we can get our Breloom or Draw Supporter. I thought I ran quite a bit of Draw Supporter as well. Why is this bad luck on hand? If either I don't get any Pokemon, I don't get any Supporters. So it's just sad. I didn't even get any of the Pokegeas. Okay, a U turn bot or Dino. I'm not sure how the opponent's deck works. I still run CCE. A Power Plant. It doesn't affect me. Hmm. How does that work? There's so many bots. Wow. She just got all the bots in one turn. That's very interesting. Well, what's the point in putting it on plug, huh? Okay, never mind. Let's see. Okay, we got some brain forest, so that's good. But our hand is still stuck, so that's not good. Ah. Now this is the time I'm hoping for my own luck to be bad. Okay, let's see what this does. 
I see. So the conclusion is we really need to get a supporter card next turn. If not, we are screwed. That's actually quite a strong deck. What to do? Why is our hand so bad? Okay, take this out. I take that out, I'm not going to get any of my energies also. Oh yeah, so many! Fine. So many supporter cards in the deck. Now I don't have speed. Mm, I was about to say that this deck, the opponent's deck, sounds good, but. After the DCE is out of rotation, I think it will not be as good. Now he can still play it. I really never see that there before. Really, I I think I have to concede. It's just a really bad luck. My luck have been so so bad with this deck. Don't know why. But let's see. Let's play a few more games. Then maybe we can have a better luck with this. Yes, let me go first again. Thank you. Uh, okay, it looks much better than the first one. Ah, okay, in this case, then I'll start charging the... Yeah, I'll start charging... My tech team, I guess. Really is good. Okay, got a fungus. Okay, good hand. Um, I don't think I need to do that now. And okay. At last, we got a decent start. Is it going jacks me? Wait, it's not going to do anything? Okay, never mind. I think it's just going to GX me, is it? Uh... 
up this appears and just going to evolve my focus. Okay, so there's a very high chance that I will lose my pectin. Not sure if I want to draw. I guess I have to draw. If you manage to wake up and attack me next turn, then I'm quite screwed. I thought he got suddenly a very good luck. I'll be very sad if that's the case. Okay, now I think he's probably a Jackie Khan straight, so I'm still quite safe. Okay, um thinking it will die. Oh, let's weakness some more. Okay, that's not an issue but we really need to get uh Shroomish at least. Give me a shroomish or a netball. Thank you. No, not thank you because the opponent is not asleep. Oh no. I made a mistake, isn't it? Yeah, I think I made a very bad mistake, but uh Well, I guess I just attack. Do I just see that this? I should. I think the opponent deck should still run at Corolla, is it? Mm hmm, okay. Oh, it's Max Potion. Why is he charge first before using Max Potion? I think I should just be here now. Okay, thank you. Please remove all these trainer cards from my hand. Uh, I still have a lot of trainer cards, but... Maybe I should just get a Shroomish for our next turn. Shroomish. Yeah, I still have a balloon.
the Ash Resistance. At least he's poisoned, so I think 10 more damage, 10 hit, 100, 10 more damage, yep, he should still die. Not sure if he can retreat. I mean, if he can retreat, I guess that's game. Now I'm just waiting. I think if he can retreat, right, I guess it's time for me to concede. Uh, if he can't retreat, means I still have chance. Okay, that also means I still have chance, obviously. Double hit, what do you expect? But, okay. I should, yeah, I should really strive for it. Erica? Erica is draw 3, Lee is draw 2, Pegasus is Lee. Okay, not the cards that I need. And uh, I think I might be putting this down. Oh, wait. Okay. Hmm. Oh, he still runs Kuzma, then that's it. But that's just unfair. Okay, I mean, we are still playing in the pre-rotation format, so I guess that's not unfair, but I mean, I'm preparing this deck for post-rotation. Yep. So that's it. So, conclusion for this game is we'll be able to put out a fight if it's not rotation wait why oh okay he still kills it oops didn't see my hand there okay I feel so bad every time I record gameplay then it will always end up in me losing all the games it wasn't like that behind the scene, you know? But I mean, I know that that is not like optimum to play now again because it's pre-rotation, but it's still not that bad, okay? Okay, let's hope we can go first. No? Okay, so this time we go second. Ah, two miss. I don't want to be in front, but... Oh, there goes Shroomish. Yeah, I guess there goes our Shroomish. That's very fast. The opponent is just moving very, very fast. There's no point. Guess we got our second shoemish. Let's take out the fungus. Put on the slumbering forest and wait for next turn. Do I need cotton picture? I draw one, but honestly, there's nothing that I'm looking for. 
so I'd rather save the custom catcher just in case we actually got two of them. Really? Why is that so good? And why you can play it so fast? Interesting. And he set up very very fast. Bye bye Chumi. Okay, go second Chumi. So okay, never mind. There are too many cards that we need to get in this turn. Hope is real. Fifty uh, percent chance is real. I didn't even need to attack. Tail. No. Feels really so bad for me <laughs> if this it still happens. But oh well. Oh, fungus. I think we can, okay, Lily is good. Maybe I should try to see what else can I get. Ninja? Well, I kind of want to feed the grass energy, so I guess I can save Cynthia for next turn. Not like this! Why is it always like this? Can you attack? Fine. Finally. Can he retreat though? He actually used Cynthia. His hand's so full he actually used Cynthia. We are a bit behind, but at least we are all one prize attacker. Yeah, we saw Rowlet comes up, but not sure if I can even get the Rowlet up. Now we just need to slowly chip this. I think bless the floor and it's still asleep, that's good. Ah. Relu. Really? What do? He has no way to retreat, is it? <laughs> Opponent's active Pokemon is not asleep. Okay, wait. Is it Erika or Cynthia? Erika or Joe's Paul? It's okay, I want to save the... Really? <laughs> Can you stop giving me things like this? I don't even have an energy. I'm very sad and my hair just sucks so bad every game. But honestly, I guess I should have gone for Cynthia. What is that burst yet? Oh. Uh, you know what? I'm not going to wait for it anymore. Breloom stop coming back to my hand. <laughs> I guess since you start, I am. 
I have resigned to my fate also. You stuck. I'm stuck. And he's actually awake. This Megaradar can start us in a lot. Next turn. Thank you. I still don't want to attack with my Among Us just in case that I cannot get Among Us next turn. Yeah. This is real. I guess if I cannot get among us, then I just depends on the spore. Okay, that's all right. Oh, okay. Well played, I guess. Ah, honestly, I'm still very, very sad. Oh, hey, it's just... Sucks. I mean, I understand the problem of post-rotation being unable to get the cards that you need and stuff, but... Not like this. Okay, lost the coin flip. Ah, I have so many basics, you know. Thank you. Well, that's a decent hand to have. Actually, that's a good hand to have. So, thank you this time. <coughs> well, not a very good opponent to have. I don't think Zapdos can one hit. Uh, except for Electro Power, of course. But, uh, I guess at least the Komala can do a chip damage to everyone's who is there? Oh, is that the Dragonite deck? Okay, he's not going to put out his Thunder Mountain now, of course. But I have another Slumbering Forest, so... I have more than enough Slumbering Forest. Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, okay. First ball is set for zero run, maybe. Oh, it's for Dragon Eye. Oh, if it has. Wait. My game just lagged. Okay, that's alright. Too bad it's Lumbering Horus. And. I don't want to put down the fungus, so I'll just go for Sin Chaos here. Bad hand, as always, but I guess we can start charging our Rowlet. I keep snoozing Komala. My luck is not that bad. Huh, I thought suddenly I'll have two haste. I wonder why he took out a Dratini. If he didn't get his Rare Candy and Dragonite, isn't it just dead? This coin is I don't want to play reset status. Not sure whether the opponent's hand is good or not. Oh, he has it. Oh wait, but it's the other dragon knight. Oh, he defeats. Okay, I think I'm done for the day. Oh, actually, never mind. One more match. We've been having bad luck and we have our decent luck in the previous game but the opponent concedes so let's try more one more game. So this will be, will be our last game. Let's see if we have we can have a decent fight this time. Let me go first, yes. Thank you. I guess another decent starting hand. Is it the time that we get our luck back? I really want this deck to work. Really, it can work. I don't know why we be having just like very bad luck. Uh, I can put that as our no worries and delete it this. I think he won't be able to kill next turn, so let's get it ready. Can put this down, no problem. Okay, done. Is there a poison there? I think we don't have our mongoose. Among okay, let's see what we can get first. 
The job is I will draw to the same as coach trainer. I can use reset stamp, not sure whether he can use blue or not. Oh. Our opponent is not asleep. I think I agree with Komala. Okay, I can wait one turn, I think that's fine. Okay, I'm really hoping my next draw will be... What is that called? Among Us. So if I can draw an Among Us, then I am more or less set. Can kill, is it? Okay. Negative draw GX. Oh, that's a new negative draw GX. It lets you draw like mad, but it resets them. Not sure whether it's going to be very useful or not. Okay. Mm, wow, I'm quite sad. If I can attack with... With Prelum this turn, that will be very good. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh. I think there's no point. My mother keeps sleeping. Should I start charging the roller? My roller is weak to fire. That's one reason I don't even want to put it up. I can one hit with GX, so... I'll do with this. Can you not wake up? Yes, thank you. My well, Kumala will die, but... My Breloom is ready, more or less. Mm, I will need to get Among Us. <sighs> okay, next time. I won't take the mark. I won't take the roller out. It's just a liability, isn't it? Maybe I should try one without roller at all. Hmm, I will consider it. I don't want Bellum to die, so after this, I'm still going to send out my Komala. Okay, go away, fire energy. Hmm. Go Komala. Okay, I should have ball for something, right? Okay, let's not take that out anymore. I still have Reloom, so they may come out. Okay, get me the Among Us. Hiya! Not yet. 
Okay, then. Hmm, okay. Another thing that I learned, I guess, is Erica's hospitality is not as good as before. I guess because we have no Ultra Ball. I mean, Ultra Ball used to be used to, like, decrease the amount of cards you have in your hand. Then now we don't really have Ultra Ball. Your hand size keeps increasing like mad. I'm going to use Reset Stem next turn. Let's hope we start. Okay, I don't think he'll ever be stuck anymore. But what to do? Honestly, it's not a bad matchup. It's just because I didn't realize it. I put down the Rowlet as liability. I guess. I guess nowadays for decks I can one hit. Tag team GX. The Rowlet is just a liability. I will learn from this then maybe I'll try this deck again when it's really really post rotation. But I think opponent's deck is really post rotation, isn't it? Yep. It's a post rotation deck indeed. I'll try again post rotation without any round alert. So I'll have no liability. Then I'll also remove ear ringing bell. Maybe change it to choice land. Is choice land out of rotation? Uh, I'll check again, but I'm pretty sure he lose this game. I mean, he killed this, he killed that. Yep, time to concede. Okay, so that's all for today. We don't really have a good luck this time, but I guess if you think about it, I feel that the deck actually works. It needs a bit of change here and there, get more consistency. Maybe I will go add and edit my uh, supporter cards also because we don't need post trainer anymore. He removed the Rowlet. Or maybe I'll just play one then. Hmm. But then it will really change the play style. But yeah. Okay, I'll make another one without the GX next time. It's really just a liability. But yeah, so that actually works. Need a bit of work. Need to find a way to get the Among Us more consistently because that's a more important card. And I guess that's all. Uh, thank you for watching then and see you guys again next time. Bye bye.